I still need me. Yeah, the, the, thank you. Thank you. Help you. Um, your sign said said uh, looking for boys and men. I thought I'm um, both. So right. All right. What? All right. Van Vanixon. Ten pairs. And um Sylvia Kurak Kiroli. Mr. Train, do you know them? They are quite pretty, aren't they? Dancing on their toes and their white dresses. Tutus. You've seen them dance in these, haven't you? Put them down. Blimey, you have. <laughs> I reckon you'd like to stay here a bit longer than the other places. And take the shoes out of the oven.
Step right up and get your tickets to the ballet. Giselle, come see Giselle. Hey, would you like a ticket to the ballet? No. Come on, you're gonna miss out on the show of the season. Do yourself a favor, see Giselle, Miss Sylvia Corrali, you won't regret it. Tickets here, you sir, you look like you could use a ticket. It's the show of the season, you can't miss it. You've been to the ballet before, do yourself a favor. Tickets to the ballet, who needs a ticket to the ballet? We've got the show of the season right here, come on down. Let me show you something. Every foot is different. In order to make a fitting pair of shoes for the girls, we ought to understand their feet. Look at this one, for example. The toes are lean, but not too long. The first three toes are almost the same length. It's quite appropriate for point work. It affects the shape and the width of a platform and a box. Now, the sole of the foot is quite curved. Her instep is very high, nice arch. Then we can measure her shank and her vamp. And the shape of her heel is absolutely important. If her heel is too long or too short, she'll slip out when she's on board. May I help you, boy? I admit Mr. Trainer sent me to deliver the shoes. It's, um, it's George, by the way. Put him over here. How long have you been working for David? Oh, a uh, couple of weeks. How is he? Oh, he's, uh, um... He's, uh, quite, quite well. I hardly remember the last time he came by to see a show. Mr. Trainer used to see the ballet. Giselle was his favorite piece. Sylvia Corelli.
let's finish it. It's about time, eh? Now, each shoemaker marks his product with a unique symbol. While good work is celebrated, mistakes are not easily forgotten. I take great pride in my compass. Now, each symbol belongs to a great maker of the past. And our job is not to ruin their good name. What should yours be? Mr. Trainer. I don't think I'm ready for one. Lovely, isn't she? Tonight's her last show of the season. One ticket, please. Wait, isn't Sylvia dancing tonight? No, she got injured at rehearsal today. But, but I saw her this afternoon. Oh. <sighs> well, here's your ticket. Enjoy the show, dear. George, can you get these to Sylvia? You made these. Can she still dance? It's hard to tell. One moment they shine like a star, the next moment they struggle to walk again. What about Diamond? Pardon? A diamond, that's your maker symbol. You can't hide in the rough forever. <laughs> 